Hello language lovers, how are you doing today? I hope you're doing fantastically well. Great. Today is going to be a very fun video. We're going to interpret 10 or 11 sounds that are made in Mozambique. Well, not made in the sense that we've invented them, but in the sense that uh, they're used in Mozambique to uh, convey meaning. But those are used mainly in Maputo, Gaza, uh, in Ambane, in the south of Mozambique. Okay? And I'd like you to tell me if those sounds mean the same or what they mean in your country. I'm going to number them so you'll tell me, for example, number one, Nigeria, it means this. Number two, Kenya, it means that. Okay? Are you ready? Fantastic. Number one, huh? Mm -hmm. This means the same as in English, which is what? You'd like the person to repeat what they just said. Okay? Fantastic. Number two. Hmm. Hmm. You see what I mean? <laughs> this means that you are in disapproval. This means that you don't believe. You want the person to convince you that what they just said is the truth. You go, hmm. Okay. Fantastic. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, number three. <laughs> This means complaining. You're complaining and you're also asking for mercy. Like, come on. Ah, okay. A lot of youngsters do this sound, obviously. The kids, yeah? Ah, okay. Great. Number four. He, he. This can go combined with Jurala, uh, which means, can you swear about it? Can you swear that this is true, what you're saying? So you go, he, you don't believe it. You're surprised. Oh my God. It's usually an alarming sentiment, okay? Number four or five, I don't remember. You go, hey, hey. This means denial. You don't accept that the fault is yours. It's not your fault. You have nothing to do with it, okay? Hey, it's not me. <laughs> Great. Number five. This means you're chasing someone away. Almost like chasing chicken or children, okay? They're messing about your stuff. You go as if leave me alone, leave my stuff alone. Okay? Great. Number six. Ah, ah. This is like an epiphany, a realization, or you finally understood something. Ah, okay? Thank you. Number eight or nine, I don't remember. You go, uh huh, uh huh. This is an approval sound. You want the person to tell you more. You're, you're following the conversation, okay? You're following what a person is saying. It's an encouragement, okay? You go, uh-huh, okay? Great. Number nine, a very strong one. I'm sure you know what that means, and that should mean the same everywhere. The stronger you do the sound, the harsher it is and the more impact it has, okay? So this is when you want to belittle someone or when you want to disregard what the person just said, okay? You think it's just rubbish, okay? You go, okay? Great. It can be negative or positive. And then finally, there is this sound that is very well known everywhere. This one is called the universal language of black people. <laughs> and I believe it's true. And the sound is, are you ready? <laughs> and the sound is, oh my God, I can't do it longer. Something like that. And this means, how dare you? It's in the sense of F off, you know? Yeah, here, here I go. Something like that. This means F off, F you, okay?
that's what it means. That was it for today. We're done. Thank you very much for listening. Please let me know what those sounds mean in your country or in your part of the world. And uh, don't forget to subscribe, please. Uh, it's very important to me for my channel. I really would like to grow more and more. So please subscribe. It's free. You don't have to pay anything, okay? You just have to click uh, the red button on, on your right, okay? And I really want to know what this means in your country. So please write down some comments about those sounds, okay? Thank you very much. Have a fantastic week. See you next time. Ciao. Ciao. <laughs> Ciao. <laughs> All right. Done.